And hello everybody and welcome back to Playframe and Monster Hunter World. We're gonna go out and hunt something else today, I don't know what though. Haven't yet got that assignment, but my objective is to speak to the commander, so let's see what he's got to say. You've done well. Nice work clearing out the camp. I knew you'd come through. And now we're finally ready. Alright Hunter, the Puke Puke hunt is on. Aha! That's what we're doing. Once you've hunted the target, the scholars will be able to get a closer look at that evidence you found. I cannot stress enough how vital taking out that Puke Puke is for the commission. This could be the break we've been waiting for. We're the ones to get it done. Good luck, and be careful. Alright. I'm gonna, but first there's one more thing that I want you folks to see, because we haven't really gone up there yet. Let's go check out the Gathering Hub. Oh yes. Look at that beautiful boat. Yes, indeed. This right here is the sort of a multiplayer gathering lobby for everybody who's on the server. You won't see the other players on your same server when you're just down there in the uh, rest of the town, but uh, if you want to play playing online with people, this is where to uh, come up and start your quests. You can uh, hang out with folks if any were in here right now. You could sit and eat with them, you can arm wrestle them, you're gonna do all kinds of nonsense. Now, let's, let me see here for a second. Hey. Welcome, welcome, the good talk. Uh, welcome to the arena a counter. We have a special quest for you today, that's right, an arena quest. Just need to think of a good name for it. Best of luck to you in there. Looks like you'll need it. Arena quests, it's the arena. There's monsters in it. You fight them, but please take your time looking at the quest list. Uh, arena quests are basically like if you want just the boss fight, not the hunt, uh, you can go into this tiny arena and fight the monster with whatever weapons they provide you and try to like just refine your technique. Not what we're going to be doing. It's a cool thing, though, and you can there are some rewards and like armor and weapon stuff that you can only get by completing those quests, so... Worth investigating. And also, by the way, now you can see, displayed by my name and the weapon that I have equipped, is the Playframe Plus Steam Group icon. Just a reminder for those of you out there, if you are interested in playing Monster Hunter together, or really any game together, uh, then join the Playframe Plus group. Because I'll be playing a lot of Monster Hunter in the downtime between episodes, and uh, it would be fun having people to play it with. So if you all want to uh, get in on that, then go join the Playframe Plus Steam group, and uh, we will uh, go hunt monsters, I guess. That's probably the thing we'll do. Anyway, got ourselves a Puke Puke to hunt today. Moving on up. All right, partner, time for us to do a little Puke Puke hunting. Once we've done that, the scholars can go in and check out that slag, see if it came from Zora Magdaros. But seriously, what other monster could it have come from? I mean, I'm no scholar, but smoldering lava rock? Hello? That is a fine, fine point you just made. But we must stay focused. We've pukes to hunt. And you know, so as long as we're talking about online stuff, once we've, uh, once we've gone out there and found the puke puke, let's fire up an SOS flare. Let's get some other hunters in on this. Just so y'all can see what sort of fun chaos happens when that happens. But first, and we mustn't ever, ever forget... Cat food. I will never, ever, ever get tired of that. So good. Okay. And I think our items should still be pretty well in order. There's a lot in here I actually don't need. I don't need this rare steak. I don't need this raw meat. Or these mushrooms. Or these toadstools. I don't need any of this stuff. No. Put it all away. Put all that away. Uh, let's go ahead and top off on some of these. 
And let's actually, to save ourselves some trouble later, let's save this loadout of items here in slot one. No, no, I mean, save this. There we go. Bingo. All right. We'll save some more robust loadouts later on. Let's hunt! Ooh, is it raining out? Oh, yeah. I think it is. It's at least very, very cloudy. No, it's raining. Look how wet it is. That's great. Now, Puke Pukes, if you've not fought them before, I want to catch this thing. Hang on. Hold that thought. No one move. I want to catch this thing so I can have it in my house. No! Ah, shoot. Come back here. Ah, I got away. Oh well, next time. Puke Pukes are uh, interesting in that they will poison you. Poison is kind of their thing. They spit poison in abundance, is what I'm saying. So, uh... It's a good thing we have some antidotes on us. If we didn't have antidotes on us, one thing that we could do is gather up some herbs and some blue mushrooms. Or maybe just the blue mushrooms, actually. Can't remember the exact recipe, but, uh... You'll definitely need some blue mushrooms. And those are pretty abundant out and around the world. We've run into quite a few of them already. Pardon me, pardon me. See, we're not even worried about these things anymore. These Jagras things. We just run right past them. A social hunter is a smart hunter. Remember to exchange guild cards with your peers. Okay, okay. All right. Easy does it. Kind of in the middle of a hunt here. Oh, Lawrence joined the quest? People can just join this now? He did! Cool, I thought I was gonna have to fire an SOS flare, but this is great. We have our first companion! For jolly cooperation! Delightful. Oh, and also some mining. So Lawrence and his cat Bill have joined the hunt. Fantastic. Let's find this darn thing. So that we may begin the assault. Uh, there's a Jagras. That's not who I'm here for. Hmm. Where would the Puke be hanging out? If I was a Puke Puke, where would I spend all of my time? Hmm. Hey, Lawrence! Welcome! Welcome to the hunt. Gotta find ourselves this thing. Wherever it hides. Aha! There you are! The Jagras and the Puke were fighting, or I guess were? I don't know, the Jagras is booking it. But we are gonna fight this thing! And it's mad. It's already mad, and already poisoning me. I barely did anything, Puke. Come on. Ow. Uh, alright, I guess I gotta actually start playing serious now. Stop being poisoned and whatnot. Drink that antidote. Now drink a potion, too. Dang. There we go. If I was smarter, I'd have also brought... Oh, hey, Lawrence is using the old dual blades. Those are fun weapons. If I was smarter, I'd have a, uh... I'd have brought some great potions along... Or mega potions along as well. I thought I had. <laughs> this is me being amateur hour over here. But whatever, I'll mount the thing. Yep, oh, brace yourselves. It's hopping. <laughs> So yeah, coming out here without mega potions and other good equipment is me being a complete amateur right here. Embarrassing myself in front of our new friend, Lawrence. But we'll be okay. We're gonna take this thing down anyway, with our fancy moves and swords. Ha ha ha! That's the stuff. Lawrence, work the tail.
We are doing incredible damage to this thing right now, and I love it. Ah, look at him go. Get him, Lawrence. Now, long swords have very good reach. Ah, stop poisoning me. Boy, that's a lot of poison. And that's an Anjanath. This just got interesting. Okay. What's he gonna do? Oh, he's coming. That's going to make this interesting. And, uh... Yeah, the bouquet has the right idea. Let's bail. Let's get the heck out of Dodge. Too young to get eaten by an Anjanath. That's gonna have to wait till at least episode five. <laughs> Don't grab... I thought this was a small mushroom, not a full-blown colony. All right. Resume combat. Now, long swords have pretty long reach, so, uh... I'm probably going to be responsible for trying to cut the tail. If you can manage to cut tails off of monsters, that usually results in an additional carve that you get to do. And everyone kind of wants that, so, uh... It tends to be pretty high priority when you can pull it off. Ow. I am still definitely learning my way around this longsword. I highly recommend <laughs> finding someone much more competent and watching one of their videos just to see what pro-tier Monster Hunter play looks like. It's pretty special. Let me resharpen here. Lawrence seems to have the Puke Puke pretty well occupied. Definitely weak on the head. And the tip of the tail seems like a weak point as well. If I can actually hit it. Hmm. Trying to get off that last hit on that spirit combo. I have yet to pull it off. Hey, come back here. Where are you going? Boo! You stuck on the tree? What's happening? Hey. You right there? Yeah, you just come back down here. I don't know what you were up to up there, but it was weird. Oh, it's mad. It's flared up its little poison sack. It's all red-faced. Monsters tend to have a- oh, and I'm stunned. That's not good. Monsters tend to have a sort of rage mode uh, once they take enough damage or just get mad enough at you. And, uh, they do more damage, they attack faster. Oh, thanks for the heal, Gwivers. What a little hero. Proud of my best cat. Ah, almost reached him. What is this thing doing? Seems to be kind of getting stuck. Hey, I got the tail! Ha <laughs> ha! That is how it's done, eventually. There we go. Finally connected that last hit. I gotta watch some more tutorial videos on this weapon. Learn my way around it. This thing has gotta be hurting by now. Ow. <laughs> is it running? It is. Well, let's carve a tail in the meantime. Before we forget. Okay. The scout flies will lead the way to wherever it's going, so let's just follow. 
If it's not already abundantly clear, I, I really cannot recommend this game enough. Especially now with Monster Hunter World, now that it is more accessible or closer to accessible than Monster Hunter has ever been. There's always been a bit of a learning curve to Monster Hunter games, and for a long time, they did a very bad job of communicating in the opening hours what was so fun about them. They've gotten better about that at, with time. Oh, geez. Oh, it's just roaring. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. He is mad, though, I think. Where are you going? Come back here. No! And what's with those hitches? Hmm. Come back here. Whoa, game. You doing all right there? Whoa. There we go. Time to give this computer a break, I think. <laughs> now stop being poisoned. Given I wasn't properly equipped, I am impressed that, uh, I've not done anything stupid like getting knocked out. Come on, stagger him. Almost. Ah, uh, he's running. Well, might as well sharpen. Where are you going? Doofy thing. Well, let's chase. Once you get a monster weak enough, they tend to start running toward their nest to uh, recover, if they can. So unless you can manage to stagger them a lot and just keep them from having a chance to run, You'll usually have to do a bit of chasing toward the end. But I think we're here. I think it's gonna nest up there. Yeah, all right. We gotcha. Ow, what hit me? Probably the tail, I guess. Ooh, can I mount it? Can I mount it? Oh! Uh! Oh, boo. I thought it would work. <laughs> That's okay. We've almost got it anyhow. Oh, I'm gonna fall asleep. These spores tend to knock you out. Come on. Almost got it. Finish it! Ah, missed. Go down! Stop poisoning us, and just go down! Eh, got an antidote again, come on. Come on, Lawrence, you got him! You got him! Finish the job! Dang, this thing's durable. Yeah! There it go! Nicely done, Lawrence and Bill and Gwibbers. A true team effort. Well done, everyone. It looks like, if I'm not mistaken, I think he's sporting the, uh... Kulayaku armor. That's a fun look. Might have to try it out later. Probably have to get some more Kulu uh, supplies, though. More materials. But yes, good hunt all around. By which I mean no one died. That counts. <laughs> 
Oh, a really cool finishing, like, uh, screenshot there, too. Rad. All right, let's take all these materials and get back to base. Excellent work putting down that Puke Puke. I knew I put the task in the right hands. Just to catch you up, we're hot on the trail of Zora Magdaros now. Listen up. But there's more to figure out. I need the fifth to protect our scholars while they investigate. I'm putting you in charge of the Wildspire Waste. The quest will begin once you've convened on site. A. Hey. Alright, it's time to begin the Elder Dragon investigation. Make sure you know what you need to do. So now we need to protect the scholars. Let's regroup at the Wildspire Waste. The Wildspire Waste is a new zone. A new environment to explore, and that'll be fun next time. Thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this monster huntering. <laughs> I certainly am. If you're not, no worries. We got plenty of other stuff to be playing and watching too. Go join the Playframe Plus uh, Steam group if you want to join in on future hunts, and uh, I will see you all next time. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.